Hello everyone and welcome oh, back. Make so much noise. Oh, okay. <gasps> Hello everyone and welcome back. Well, hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. So in today's video we are trying the infamous dun, dun, dun. Chicken George. Um for many people that don't know, Chicken George is like a viral chicken shop that went um like it went it blew up on like TikTok and Facebook and stuff in in like the second lockdown I think it was um and we'll insert a few pictures of it here and here we come to Hitchin yeah it's, just... it's based in Hitchin there was one in Luton but that one shut down so should we tell them what we got yeah so we got two Bossman chicken burger meals so and standard chicken burger let me get it chips and a drink mm. we got some wings and we got some uh chicken strips chicken strips as well it's really hot in this car that's the receipt. So twenty-seven pounds seventy-five. We've got quite a fair bit though. Fair bit, yeah. So sorry if this has changed a bit. We've just um, changed the camera angle because you can't really see the rest of it. The wings that we got were the honey barbecue ones, which were the honey barbecue sauce, crushed frazzled, and chives. Um, the chicken strips are just plain ones, and in the Bossman chicken shops, so we got one each. Was American fried chicken fillet with mayo and lettuce. It was the quickest shop. I've ever been served. It was, it was very quick. Yeah, if you're going to KFC, I don't know, what, yeah. obviously I can't speak for every KFC, but, but the ones that we are. go to, we have to wait, what, yeah. 20 minutes sometimes? Easy, if not longer. We was, it, we was in Chicken George for what? Five minutes, Five if that. Minutes. Yeah. Service was 10 pen. Yeah, service was 10 10, and they were busy in there as well. And as we were walking back to the car, a lady said that smells so yeah. good. Oh, we also got in this bag, there's drinks and sauce. So I got a Pepsi Max and Lewis got a Rio. Huh, lovely, thank you. I hope the chips are good. Yeah. I, don't, I hate it when chips are, are done poor. They don't look seasoned. Do you want a fork? Nah, I'm going hand in. Oh, it does look nice. Oh. Mmm. They are seasoned with something. They are seasoned already. With what are? Mmm. I just... Oh, look how many mine are seasoned. Look at yours. You're really plain looking, look. Oh. Oh, come on. Mmm, good bag. You would like yeah. a burger at the same time. Yeah, I was thinking we should play Would You Rather. Or like Snog Mary Boys. Who would you invite to a dinner party? Famous. Okay. Or dead or alive. How many people? You're allowed eight people. Oh god. It's right. a big dinner party. Mm, that's a tough one. You can have couples. Do you know who I would like to be there? Who? Joey Essex. Why? Because he really makes me laugh. I think he'd, he'd just be the entertainment. Um, mm. This looks nice. Yeah, they are good. Tyson Fury, maybe? Why? Because he's very interesting. Mm. Bob Marley. Why? Got our Bob there. I just feel like Bob would have a lot to say. Would he? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Dua Lipa's got to be there. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's a dream girlfriend. No. Yeah. You're my dream girlfriend. Who else would I have? Who have I said so far? Well, like a sport personality or a politician or an uh, actress, actor, historical figure, I don't know. Henry VIII. Why? don't know, why not? What seats to fill? Because they'll eat all your food. Yeah, that's true. Um, look at that. That looks really, really good. It's brioche, I think. It is brioche. Mm. Oh, it's hot. Mm. That is really nice. Mm -hmm. Really nice. It tastes like actual chicken, you mm. know, like sometimes uh, it tastes a bit processed, but mm. no, this is really good. It's quite big, isn't it? Mm. It's a big bit of weight, isn't it? We've got like five people. Sorry, what else I'd have? Good. Gemma Collins. <gasps> what Gemma Collins? And then. Um, you don't know who this is, but I'd probably have Sam Carter there as well. No idea. Um, <clears throat> and then... Mm. I've got one more person. Mm -hmm. Who am I having? I'm having Dua Lipa. I can have the Muppets next. Bob Marley. You said Tyson Fury. Tyson Fury. No, that's it. 
Joey Essex, Gemma, Gemma, Collins. Gemma Collins. That's fine. Um, who else did you pay me out? No, but I decided against it. Fuck, we didn't even food. Yeah, what about Adam from Beer Meets Food? Mm. I'd have him. Why though? Because I like him. Just to meet him? Yeah, and meet him. Watch him, watch him eat. Yeah. What about you? Um, so I think mine would be very music based though. Mm. So I would have Ed Sheeran there. I would have Drake there. I'd have Dave there. <laughs> um, um, what's that lady? I don't know, sit down. Um, like Ball Church and that. Oh, quite a bit of seasoning. Olivia Coleman, the actress lady. And the one that was in Ball Church and, um, that's what she in. She's doing loads of stuff. I like her. Hard actually. How would I have? I think just, I just stole something. Did you run out of a whole basket for of stuff? Oh, why are you see a little pound now, man? It's not pound anymore. Mm. Can't think of anyone. It's a hard question, isn't it? Oh, do you know what else I've got there? Who? You? No, you wouldn't. Okay, I wouldn't. Would you not want me your one? No. Not if you have Drew and Luca there. You wouldn't want me there. What's the word? You wouldn't. What do you think is going to happen between me and Drew Lee, but? She might love you. No, I don't think she would. <clears throat> I might not love her. I love you. You love her money. Yeah, money's not everything, though. Um, Will Smith. She ain't before you any more fights than anyone else. Right, I just think of um, another topic now. As we're eating fried chicken, if I was going to get KFC, what would I get for dinner? I think a burger box meal with a flaming wrap. You're not wrong. There's, cu there's a couple options, I'd say. Yeah, exactly, and that's one of them. So mm -hmm. I was right. And what would I get? You don't really eat KFC that much anymore. No, you'd probably get the same, but you wouldn't get the wrap, would you? No. And I wouldn't get the wrap as well. You'd probably change the wings to a piece of chicken. Sometimes I do, yeah. Do you think the chicken's a bit hard to chew? No. I don't think we've got to pull it away now. It's a bit tough. Right, so when you've been outside, no one can watch us. Would you rather be interviewed by Piers Morgan or be interviewed by Louis Theroux? Louis Theroux. Well, I don't hate him, he's just a bit of a... My money don't jiggle jiggle. It folds. We need to do that TikTok dance. Actually, yeah, she should. And I feel like Louis Theroux would ask in, 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 interesting questions. Yeah, he does, but you'd have to answer them. Yeah, that's alright. Well, it depends what they're about. It depends what. That bit's sticking out the top. Oh, we're doing a collab with a white car. A collab? Not a collab. Same thing, though. Right, right, ask me a question now. Keep asking you everything. Last meal on death row. Well, that was a good one. But I would have. This is me being generally serious, this is what I'd have. For breakfast, I would have Bill's pancakes. Restaurant bills and a protein smoothie that I make mm -hmm. with peanut butter in it and on the pancakes and fruit on the pancakes. Then, mid morning snack, I would have some Pringles salted, just plain salted because they're the best flavour. That is lunchtime. I would have lunch, I'd probably have maybe like a BLT but in like a big crusty baguette and more Pringles and some Ben and Jerry's and um, dairy free ice cream. Afternoon snack, I would have chocolate covered raisins. And for dinner, I would have um, Nando's quarter chicken with spicy rice and chips and garlic bread and halloumi and hummus and pita bread. And then round the whole night off with two pommes and martinis. That would be what I'd eat. And that'd be a good day. It's death row, isn't it? So. Yeah, but it'd be a good day of food and then I'd die. Mm, yeah. So, at least I know that I've eaten all the best food that I like. Yeah. What do, you, what do you get? We're doing the whole day. Oh. That was a fad, wasn't it? Come <laughs> on. Probably start the doff eight. Huh? Start the doff eight. Start the doff. <laughs> oh, oh my God. <laughs> What's a doff eight? I don't know. I wish I knew. I'd probably start the day off with, mm -hmm. I'm going to say a fry up. Yeah, but what would you have in the fry up? Sausages. Mm -hmm. Bacon. How many of each? Mm, just about. Say two of each. Okay. So sausages, bacon, beans. Obviously, I'm not going to have two beans, but a portion of beans. Black pudding. Black pudding is a must. Uh, two eggs. Mm, some toast. Oh, I think that'll do me. 
can probably all right. Mm. Oh. Pasta? Yeah, if I had a couple of ashes as well. Um, and then for lunch, I was thinking the same as you, like BLT sort of thing. Yeah, like a proper but, big one. Yeah, if not like a big like roll, probably have like chicken and ham and some sort of bacon in it and mm. then lettuce, maybe red, red onion, a bit of mayo and then dinner. That's what you do, no snack. Oh, I don't really snack. No, but you're going to die. Oh right, yeah, well I get a cannoli then for a snack, <laughs> but it's got to be from Sicily. Um, and then dinner, I'd probably, I'd have to go steak. I'd have yeah. to, I'd have to go steak. But it'd be, <clears throat> what's the one they do the Ming, uh, in, why can't I speak today? What's the one they do in Millennium Carter? Chateaubriand? Yeah, I, I, I'd have to have that. I'd have to get lobster tail with it as well. A Chateaubriand, medium rare, chips, lobster tail, uh, maybe a wedge of salad. You don't like mac and cheese, do you? No. Remember the cream spinach we had? Mm. And the uh, flat iron. Yeah, that, that, that is that so was good. Really, really good. For dessert, I'd probably get. Oh, what was it? Sticky toffee goodness. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like some sort of like warm chocolatey baked good with some ice cream. So, like, melt, I melt in the middle pud or like brownie, something like yeah. that. Because I love chocolate. Let's have a look what we got in here then. Mmm. A bit smaller than KFCs, but they look a bit fatter, mm. to be fair. Mm. Oh, but, mm. that burger is lovely. Would you rather go bungee jumping or skydive? I don't think I could do either. Mm, you have to. Bungee jumping. But that, you're, then you're constantly having to look at the height, aren't you? Whereas mm. if you skydive, you're only going, you're going to get lower. You're only going down, yeah, I suppose. I think I'd skydive. Would you? Mm. Do you want that chip? It's very seasoned for you. Thank you. Mm, but I really like Perry chips. These are nice, but um, I'd just choose plain chips if they had them. I'm good for plain Jane. I like that. It's good. Try a bit. Okie dokie. I'm my chips. Wow. They smell really, really good. Where's the frazzles? In. Oh, they're well saucy. Proper coated. That was a weird noise, wasn't it? Yeah, what was that? Mm chicken. Something went crunch. Hmm. Don't like it. No, nice. I was expecting a little bit more though, to be honest. Why? Oh. What's wrong with it? No. I was expecting better flavour. Oh. Given the rest of the stuff we had. Still nice. Well chicken George, stop what you're doing. Because Lewis doesn't like the wings. I never said I don't like them. I can tell your face. <laughs> I can literally tell your face. I can't help it. What about the bottom scrunch wings we did or them? Those. Oh, right. Yeah, but I really don't rate them. No, but they're nice. You're just fussy. Did it hurt? What? When you fell from heaven. I'm not keeping that in. What's your favourite restaurant? Tough one, isn't it? In terms of what cuisine. Finished, ate it all. It's quite a lot there, isn't it? Like Turkish or Lebanese, I'd say yellow yellow. Thai, Thai cottage in Burko. Chinese, banana leaf, I think that's also Thai. Or Malaysian. Stay fast for Prime. Uh, what are your favourite rest? Oh, can I have the last bit? What do you think of it? Nice. Nice. I like the dish. Better than the Sudex and KFC. Yeah. Um, Come on, you, look, you eat out loads. Probably Prime is my favourite restaurant. Followed closely by. Mm, between Patuti and Latista, I'd have mm. to go Patuti. Mm. Not necessarily because the food is better, but the service is better in Patuti. Yeah. What's your current favourite song at the minute? What I've been listening to. Yeah, that you like currently. I was listening to Over and Over Again by Nelly featuring Tim McGraw. I don't think I've ever heard it. You've got to find it. Oh. And. <clears throat> right, I'm going to trial wing now. Lucy doesn't like them. They look very similar to the bottomless brunch ones. Oh, they're well sloppy. Mm. <clears throat> I'm trying this one. Tim McGraw is a bit, um, well, he's not a bit, he is, he is like a country artist. So this song come on after. So I had it on on Alexa. A song came on after by a chap. I can't remember his name now. I think it's Jason something. Called um, "Take It From Me." I like that. That's quite. It's a bit weird. It's like an upbeat sort of like country song. How's it going? I'm not singing it. Why? No. Have I heard it. No, you wouldn't have heard it. I wouldn't have thought. Um, I adore you. Freddie Gibbs. Oh, I adore you. That's a good song. Um, what about you? I cleaned it pretty much. My fingers are warm. You know what I mean, anyways? Mm, no. You 
them and I'm like, I feel like I should, but I'm not. Uh, they're not. They're not bad, no. but I'm not. I was expecting better things from them wings. To be fair, maybe that's just me. Yeah, which favourite song at the moment? Well, so you. <laughs> you're out. Good thing you're going to get your nails done, isn't it? It's called <coughs> Too Much by Kid Leroy. Have you heard it on the radio? Uh, maybe. I like. I like that kid. Mm. He's good. I don't know who sings it, but it's on the radio currently. How's it go? I'm not seeing it. Go on. I'm not. You can cut it out. No. What's that sound? That's the pop, isn't it? Why is it making a popping sound? I don't know. It popped me as well. The wings are okay, but I wouldn't get them again. No, I wouldn't get the wings. If I was going to get wings again, I'd just get normal yeah. like fried chicken wings. Because their they're burger and their strips were they were good. I won't. Done. Yeah, I will. Thank you. These wipes are a bit weird. Yeah, they're a bit small, weren't they? Yeah. <laughs> that was tasty, man. That, that was, was lovely. tasty. I'd give it 8.5 out of 10, and the wings lay it down. Yeah. Yeah, I would I would say... I'd say 8.5. Yeah, I would agree with that. 8.5, potentially a 9, because it was good. The service in there was, like Charlotte said, tame saying it was... So it was quick. in there for five minutes and there was a couple of people in front of us like when, yeah. we, when we got there it's not like we walked in and got served straight away we we had to wait um but still within five minutes we had yeah. we had ordered and got our food um so that that was really good the burger was really nice really mm, nice that burger was so good proper nice the strips were nice i wouldn't say they were as good as the burger no i'd probably only just get the burger again yeah and the chips, you got a lot of them. To be fair, yeah, there was a lot of chips. They were, they, they were, they were all right. They were like fries, though, weren't they? Yeah. Like skinny. But that's what I like. You don't like them. Oh yeah, I, 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 I prefer chips, personally, but still nice. And then the wings, I, I was, maybe it was the sauce that they put on it. Yeah, it's too sloppy for me. Yeah. So hope you enjoyed it. If you did, big Please thumbs give up. Give it a big thumbs up. And we'll see you and in the we'll next see one. See you in the next one. Bye. Bye. Bye.